Okay, so I had this question posed to me. It was asked, do I know anything about like part-time PA programs? Is that a thing? And so I wanted to talk to you guys about it um, really last. It's gonna be a quick video because um, there is part-time programs and I'm gonna address that for you, but I just wanna like put a little caveats to it. So if you're interested in what it is like or what it means to have a part-time PA program, this video is for you. So let's get into the video right now. All right, what's up you guys? It's Adana, welcome back to my channel. Okay, so like I said, I had the question asked, is there like part-time programs? Is there such a thing as a part-time program? And the answer is yes, there is. And so um, I just wanted to touch on that. Uh, I specifically saw like one program that is part-time. There are several programs that is part-time, but you actually need to like look a little bit deeper into it because there are PA programs that are part-time, but they're a bachelor's to master's PA degree. So you already need to be a PA, already need to have had like a certificate or a bachelor's degree. And then you're just trying to be almost grandfathered in, but really like take the courses to get your master's degree. So there is that. However, there is an actual part-time PA program where you go to school part-time. So most PA programs are about two years, like 24 to 27 months. My program was 27 months. Um, I have students that rotate with me and their program is 24 months. So that is like typically the time that it takes to get through PA school. However, there are some PA programs that are actually 36 months. Now, again, you have to be mindful that there are some PA programs that are dual programs and masters of public health, as well as a masters in PA medicine. And then there are some PA programs that um, give you a longer, uh, I would say like rotation schedule. So that time is just like extended a bit, okay? So just keep that in mind. But the program that I'm going to tell you about right now is actually three years and it's three years because it is part-time and you can go to this program while like living your life, right? You know, not everybody can like stop what they're doing for two years to go to PA school. You know, some of us have husbands and wives and families and jobs and other responsibilities where you have to take care of like people in your family and if that is you and you are still trying to like kind of better yourself or get into this career that you wanted to get into then this program is for you and it's the University of Detroit Mercy's program um it is a part-time program, fully part-time, in that it takes three years to actually get through this program. And with that being said, you will be like, there are times when you're expected to be on campus to actually like have testing or do um, some of like the skills portion of PA school. However, it is part-time, meaning that you can hold down like a full-time, part-time job while attending this program. So I'm gonna leave the information for that program for you in the description box below. But I definitely suggest for those of you that may be like looking at this as, as a second career, or even if it's your first career, but you're just trying to find something that will afford you the opportunity to still provide for your family or for yourself or whatever responsibilities you have while at the same time pursuing this career and this goal that you have, this program is probably one to look at. So again, I will leave it in the description box below. It is the University of Detroit Mercy. Go ahead and check it out. All right, so if you guys have any other questions for me, leave them in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram, edit on the PA. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will talk to you guys next time.